and 70s that I think were ahead of their time. Movies released too late. Black Widow. I love this movie. It always ends up in my top 10 in my MCU rankings. But I think releasing it after Endgame, after they already killed off the character, when it should have been a Phase 2 or 3 movie, shortly after the first Avengers movie, would have made more sense. And, as much as I love the movie, I would have also liked for it to be an origin story. Incredibles 2. Ultimately, I think this movie should have just been called Elastigirl, since the main character is not the family dynamic, it's just Elastigirl. I don't mind that the characters weren't aged up, I just wish the story had focused more on the superhero family. And another movie that was released too late, Indiana Jones 4 and 5. There are many problems with these movies, mostly the script, but what it comes down to, in my opinion, is that nobody really wants to see Indiana Jones as a sad, broken old man. The appeal of Indy is that he's a male fantasy. He fights Nazis, he flirts with beautiful women, and he can't really do that when he's 70 or 80 years old. Movies that were ahead of their time? Tron Legacy. Since Legacy sequels are so big right now, such as Force Awakens, Ghostbusters Afterlife, Top Gun Maverick, I think if they released this movie now, it would be better received. Especially because AI and technology are such hot button topics right now, I think they could do something interesting with it. Big Mind. When this movie came out, the MCU was still in its infancy, and I don't think a lot of people at the time really knew what to make of this movie, because we didn't get 10,000 superhero movies and shows every year, so I think if they released it now, they would appreciate the satire a bit more. It has gotten a bit of a cult following on the internet over the past few years, but it took almost 15 years for it to gain that following because it was released a bit too soon. Abandoned Way franchises such as Percy Jackson, The Fifth Wade, and Divergent. Every author was trying to create the next YA franchise in a post-Harry Potter world, so naturally Hollywood is gravitating towards those kind of stories. But I think audiences were so burnt out by the genre at the time, since we were getting Harry Potter, Twilight, and Hunger Games around the same time, that ultimately it just became too much. I think now that the YA craze has slowed down and we have a new generation of a YA audience, if they tried to do Fifth Wave and Divergent now, they would have been able to adapt all the books. They're at least doing a Percy Jackson show on Disney+, Plus, and I think they read that they're trying to get more Maze Runner movies off the ground, and I know for sure that Suzanne Collins is working on a new Hunger Games book, and that's also going to be a movie in a couple of years, and I really hope that the YA genre gets revived, because I want to see a TV series of Suke to Freak, because I love that movie, and I'm really hoping that we get a Mistborn movie or show down the line, too. So there you go, there are some movies that I think were released too soon, and movies that were probably released a bit too late. Let me know what you guys think.